Right, welcome back everyone. Now, next job to do is hit this chassis with a needle scaler. This should take off any of the loose surface rust and uh, flaky paint that's all over the chassis. So yeah, I have pressure washed it. I didn't show you that. Well, I haven't pressure washed it actually, that's a lie. I was gonna pressure wash it, but the pressure washer broke. So what I did was just went over it with a garden hose. I don't know how well it's done on it, to be honest, but. So, I washed it off. I don't know if you remember, but there was tons of mud over the top of all of this. And just everywhere. It was just caked in mud. But now what we need to do is hit it with the needle scaler and uh, give myself Parkinson's for the rest of the day. Because <laughs> this is gonna vibrate the living life out of me. Um, yeah, I'm just getting... Sorry, ran out of battery there. Um, but yeah, hit it with a needle scaler and uh, start knocking some flaky paint off and rust. So, come across the first problem. That is meant to be solid. It's one of the body mounts in the middle, but it is right behind the wheels. So obviously that one's gonna be taking the most abuse. But uh, I'll carry on scaling and see where else we're gonna get holes. I think over there we might get some. Yeah, we'll... Um, carry on chipping away. I think I might get get the hammer out and just start tapping with the hammer as well, take off all the big lumps and go from there. Oh, so I've been going at that a couple of hours now. It's starting to look all right in there. It's quite satisfying when you get all the comes out quite nice. So obviously, it starts off sort of like this and a little bit crusty, and then it's almost shiny. Yeah. It does take some doing. I'll probably have, if I had a good day on that, it might might be done in a day. What I will eventually do is lift the back end up the tractor and try and go as far as I can under there. The diesel tank has got to come out, so what I'll do is 
bury it in the back corner somewhere so I can still get to it with a tractor and uh, lift the back end up. Um, but it's out of the way because obviously I won't have a diesel tank on it. There are a few rusty spots where it's blown through but I don't think that's too major. I might see if I can get one of those brackets. I'm debating whether to do the brake lines while I'm here because you think this is the only time the tub's going to be off to actually get to all the bolts and everything so yeah I don't know but I might, I might not I'll take that shock off like I've done the other side and nibble away in here yeah getting there slowly I don't know if you can hear that but the boys in the boys on the bike so going down the lane behind the farm oh no I'm gonna have to move you for a minute Nice it would be to have a cameraman. Are you even looking? Yeah, you are. I don't think you, you can't have seen that because it was all a blur. Correct use of a chisel to get a shock off that. Oh, I'm too hungover for this. Take this exhaust off, see how well this will go. Oh my good God. Well, that's just sort of house, isn't it, really? Surprised that came undone that easy. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, balls. Be an 
Look at that. Prowess of my engineering skills right there. So that's how that's coming on. It's what it's like after it's been needle scaled. Obviously I'll do the, the back of this bar once I've taken the tank out. There's a little bit more to do, but I'm pretty much 90% of the way there, I think, now. I've taken that bracket off. I was just seeing how difficult those bolts would be to undo because what I think I'll do is um, just cover them in copper grease um, before we uh, put the rough treating primer on this the other thing I did think about was if they do, if it does all come off easily get this sandblasted because this is like 5 mil thick box that if you just take the whole whole thing off, I've got from the sandblast. We'd probably do that and um, repaint it. But yeah, don't know. Not sure. You see, I still got to do underneath everything as well. Um, probably gone as far forward as I need to really, because once you get past there, forward is. is like brand new, but uh, yeah, that's it so far. That's that for this video, I think. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Yeah, leave leave a comment. Any ideas of what else I can do for treating rust and stuff like that? And uh, yeah, see you in the next one.